update. All points target update. We have hostiles on the Reagan upper deck. Targets will be marked. Make that first approach count. Launch. Launch discretionary. Get up there. Go, go. Don't rocket me now. Don't rocket me now. No, 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 no! He might be doing a Devastator as Devastator goes through walls. Yep, Devastator. Get him, Frank! Get him, Frank! Be a hero! Be close enough. Please be close enough. Yeah, it's definitely close enough. I think what I need to do is try to have as many people consumed as possible. Okay, he's doing his own! We're fine, we're fine. I need to have as many people consumed as possible. If my health's full when we get to that one minute mark, I think it'll be easy. I should just be able to smack him with a Devastator. No, anyway, I should, if, if that's the case at that point in time, I should be able to smack him with a Devastator, beat him up, smack him with a Devastator, smack him with a Devastator, call it a day. This whole run consumed devastate. I don't know why it wasn't working the first time I tried it, but it seems to be working out okay now. Is he stunned? No. Frank, 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 everybody! Frank, Frank! Get the fuck out, because he's gonna... Is it? This is Red Crown to all crew. We'll remain on station to coordinate. The bomb. Everyone else needs to abandon the Reagan right now. Support vessels to perform pickup duty and retreat to minimum safety. That is a general order. Abandon the Reagan right now. Stunned? No. Any helicopters with open spots, please land and pick up crew and injured on the upper deck. Bring them home, people. Come on! Frank! 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 There's no people over here. There's no fucking people over here. Oh, he did. Hey! Sean Killer, I'll read that in a minute. Ugh. One minute remaining. Fuck it. Frank, you've done us all a service. It's time for Alex. Let's tango, big fella! Come on! You and me! Let's go! Fuck! Fuck! Fucking! Wow! Wow! Fuck! Abandoned ship! All crew abandoned! He fucking gutted me at the absolute perfect time to stun me in my invulnerability phase. If I don't get stunned at that exact point in time, if I don't get fucking gutted at that exact one moment in time, then I Devastator him and I win right there. But he picked the absolute perfect- I should have just avoided it, but he picked the absolute- Actually, I think if I would have avoided it, I would have lost my Devastator anyway. Absolute fucking perfect only moment that could have won him the fight there, so that was-
fucking, I guess, well played on the CPUs then. My bad. I don't think I fucked up. I think I just got hit by the one move that could stop me from winning at the exact moment I needed to get hit by that move. I think that's what happened. That sucked ass, but oh well. I mean, I'm gonna get this fight eventually. I know how to do it. Until I get hit by a rock and lose half my health that I've been running around working for. What the fuck? Didn't he do that three days ago? I thought he hit the ground yesterday. I thought he hit the ground yesterday. I was like, okay, the move's over now. And then on the other end of the ship, I take damage. Whatever, here we go. He's gonna get close to me and try to devastate her. I'm pretty sure that's just what he does after you beat him up. I was carrying one of their people and I took a rocket to the base. I swear to god, the rockets, whatever rockets they have now, do more than they did to me in the beginning of the game. When I had a smaller health bar, I would live a lot longer. Like, I don't know, the rockets wouldn't take nearly as much of it away. It's like upping my health didn't do me any good. Maybe he won't devastate her. Fuck if I know. I need more people to consume though, or this isn't gonna work. But there are no more people because they're all dead. Oh, here we go. I thought I pushed circle, but I guess I pushed take a rocket to the face. Yeah, that's what I wanted a fucking car door. Still need more people. I wish he would devastate her so I could get a minute, but see and again every time I go to consume somebody, they stop the giant thing that's murdering all their guys. I guess I'm doing it too, but now I'm dead. Okay. If I can pull off a couple more, I'd be good. This dude is still following me, okay. I'm glad bumping him in the air doesn't take half my health away. It seems like something was game I try to pull, but... He should be within range. Yeah. He took damage from it. I should have picked somebody up. I was expecting the cutscene to happen. Oh, there it is. Okay, good. Ground to all crew. We'll remain on station to coordinate. The bomb. Everyone else needs to abandon the Reagan right now. Support vessels to perform pickup duty and retreat to minimum safety. That is a general order. Abandon the Reagan right now. Any helicopters with open spots, please land and pick up crew and injured on the upper deck. Bring them home, people. 
As I say, I wanted to use my Devastator, but if he was going to use his, I cannot be anywhere near him for that, or I will probably just die. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? He had more Devastator, apparently. What the fuck? He can shield that? That's the lamest shit I've ever seen. That back. Alex still talking shit. Still didn't give me a fucking glide mission. There you have it. Would have been so much more hype if I just would have killed him the first time and wouldn't have got bullshitted to death when I knew how to beat him, but oh well. GG's. And we know the code now because we consumed the guy who knew the code, so we know how to turn off the nukes. Batman stole its ending from Prototype. What the hell? I looked for the truth. Found it. Didn't like it. Wish the hell I could forget it. Alex Mercer. The city suffered for his mistakes. For what he did at Penn Station. And whoever he was, that's a part of me. Because when I close my eyes, I see the memories of a thousand dead men screaming as I take their lives. Moments I'll relive forever. What have I become? Something less than human? but also something more. News One has confirmed that a nuclear weapon of unknown origin has detonated 10 to 15 miles offshore of southern Manhattan. Estimates place it at roughly five times the size of the bomb dropped at Hiroshima. Is there anything you'd like to say? Uh, no, I, I guess I just tell everyone we're okay. You know, we're gonna be okay. New York will bounce back. Hey man, if it wasn't for the Marines, we'd be dead. All of us. They risked their lives to save us. We owe them. I have Sergeant Detweiler here with me. Sergeant, what can you tell us about the present state of the infection? Since last night, nothing. They don't seem driven in the same way. They're not a real threat anymore. It's been 10 minutes since the Vice President has been on the ground. Senator Ambrose is expected to make a statement. New York has weathered the first act of biological and nuclear terrorism in the history of the world. It is a testament to the men and women of the United States Armed Forces that New York is still standing. We will find those responsible. We will drag them out of their hiding places. And we will make them pay. Wherever they are, wherever they are, whatever weapons they possess, 
they will learn the final lesson. America does not start wars, America ends them. Thank you. I believe that's prototype. So, small recap. Alex Mercer unleashes the evil virus started at Hope. Alex Mercer becomes the evil virus started at Hope. Virus begins to take over Manhattan because Alex Mercer, the virus, releases Elizabeth Green, who helps it take over Manhattan. She is also part of the virus. Alex Mercer kills Elizabeth Green, finds out how to stop the infection, or stop it from spreading at least, realizes there's a solution, but the military says, nah, it's too late, we want to blow up Manhattan. Alex Mercer saves the mil or saves Manhattan from being blown up by the military. All the while, while his solution to everything pretty much just being to kill everyone. But there it is. End of the day, Alex Mercer saves it. Beco becomes... The young hero, but there you go. That is the uh, that is the prototype. I don't know. A lot of times I was salty. A lot of times I hung on. But I do think my la the last death that I got there was pretty much BS because it was been so fucking cool to just beat the game right there. Because I knew what the hell I was doing. Obviously, I did it easy peasy the next time around. But uh, no, good game, good game. I think I'm mainly drawn to this game. I mean, number one, the mobility, the combat's pretty solid. But Alex's characters, super cool. The only thing I think I would change is you only really have one fight that's with another like person your size that's kind of a big deal and you have the fight with the uh electric zappy dude he had a fucking taser he had a, he had a lengthy taser in the beginning of the game like near the beginning of the game and other than that you're pretty much just fighting giant hunters um i wish the combat was just a tad more in depth so that way most of the solution everything wasn't too uh, hit and run away and hit and run away and hit and run away. And I mean, even to the final boss, it was taken to the grandest scale of them all, where it was Devastator and run away unless I could waylay on him. Other than that, I mean, I'm, I'm still a big fan of the combat. There's lots to do in this game. I could go back and clear all the events. I could, uh, go look for the hit markers, uh, the hit markers and the, uh, hidden landmark collectibles and things like that. But it, and then obviously crank up the difficulty if you want to and play again or if you want to play on the same difficulty but if you if you've ever thought in a game before you know it would be cool if i could have all the powers i have at the end of the game at the beginning of the game you can do that um you can't carry it over to a different difficulty however for this game if i wanted to i could uh i could s start a new game but i could go in the new game plus mode and what that means as far as this game is concerned meaning that i can start another game i, I played in normal played on normal difficulty for this one i could start another game on normal difficulty and i could have all the powers all the ev points all the powers everything i had at the end of this game at the beginning of that one so i can just play through the game again but have completely godly op powers the whole time through and by the end of the game have every unlock in the game so probably by the middle of the game to be honest have every unlock in the game which would be super awesome um, but yeah, that is, uh, that is prototype people. If you were on YouTube, I hope you guys enjoyed the prototype playthrough. I will not be playing prototype two question. I get very often. Um, uh, apparently prototype two's gameplay is just as good as prototypes. If not a little bit better from what Simba has been saying in chat. Um, it's a little bit shorter than prototype one, but it's just as good. You play as a different protagonist, but due to, the way that the story unfolds and how the game ends, I don't like it, so I'm not playing it. I will not be playing Infamous either, because that's essentially just what I played. They came out at the same time, very similar games. Uh, but I got Prototype first, and I like it, so I'm not going to play Infamous. And yeah, that's about it. That's about all I got. I think that's coming out. I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. Next playthrough should be happening relatively soon. Uh, with any luck, I might come at you with... I don't know. I don't know. I've kind of revealed it before. Um... Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, I've kind of revealed it before. I don't know if... It, just the next playthrough will be coming soon. Wh whatever it is. Whatever is coming, it'll be on its way within the next couple of days. Glaze should still be going strong. I think I still have a bit of Glaze left up at this point. On. But yeah, please leave a like if you guys enjoyed this series. If you guys enjoyed this playthrough, uh, leave a comment. It helps me out a lot. As always, I'm Thundershot. I'm out. Peace, late, and see ya.